right, welcome back to Thrive America. We're kind of finishing things up with our guest today, Jay Cap, uh, with Cap Concepts with a K. Uh, Jay does amazing work, amazing websites. Uh, if you're looking for a website, you don't want to have your, your cousin Hal do it. Uh, you want to have a real professional come and do your website so it can look great, um, it can be discovered on the internet, and it can drive traffic and, and be used as a, as a powerful tool to get business. Um, to recap some of the things we've already talked about with Jay, he talked about um, some, some ways you can use the internet, some sites you can use for free to brand yourself, to begin marketing yourself. So if, if you're starting uh, a new business, some of these tools you can use right away. If, if, you're, if you're in business right now, you can jump on and do a lot of these things uh, within just a couple minutes. One is creating a Facebook page, a Facebook fan page, uh, creating a LinkedIn business profile. Uh, if you have a destination uh, business, you can you can go to Google Maps and upload your logo and, and then start getting indexed on Google Maps. Uh, so Jay, uh, we're going to kind of uh, talk about your last two points here. Uh, you talk about kudzu. Um, what what is uh, what is kudzu? Kudzu, kudzu is an online business directory. Uh, they they're in various cities around the country. They you know, they're owned by Cox, so they they have a hmm. big big uh, footprint here in Atlanta. And, and you know any business can go get a free listing on Kudzu, and it's they can put up some basic information about their company, their address, and their phone number, and their website link, and, and you know the hours that they're open and the services they provide. So, so it's like a Yellow Pages, maybe, or sure, I, I would, it's similar to that. Yeah, mm -hmm. I mean, basically a, a bunch of businesses organized by categories, and, mm -hmm. and people can search online. People can also rate the businesses, give reviews. Um, and then the businesses can also pay if they, you know, beyond the free one, they can pay to have a better placement in the search results. Is this this is just for the local Atlanta area? Yeah. Yeah. Okay. The, okay. Their site, uh, they have different portals for different cities. So okay. when, you, when you go and you're in Atlanta, they, you know, they ask you which city you're, you're in. Yeah. All right. So if I'm a business, I can I can find maybe a local kudzu and get and, and submit my information, and create kind of a kind of a, a business profile on exactly. kudzu. Exactly. Exactly. Uh, do. Do they have a rate? You said a rating system, and so forth. Is I, I'm on Kudzu, and I've one. I've always wondered how to get uh, more, more, more uh, attention to my Kudzu. I, I haven't figured that out. Well, I mean, if you if you want to do it without spending money, I would suggest you'd ask uh, ask people that worked with you to give you a review. Gotcha. Because one of the ways that people can search and sort the results of their search are by the top reviews. So they can uh, they can see the the different types of companies. They can see the web design companies that have the top reviews, or the, or the marketing companies, or the video production companies that have the the top reviews. Gotcha. So so a good idea is if you've done business with somebody, uh, and you're on Kudzu, just ask them to write a review. Maybe send them a link to the re review page, and just say, hey, if you're happy with the way we did business, can you write a quick review? And that can bump up your Kudzu ranking, maybe. Yes. Okay. Yes. yes. Uh, so forth. I know they have paid. Categories as well for kudzu, right? Uh, as well. Okay, your final your final topic is YouTube. And you, you, you uh, uh, YouTube as a way to uh, business can create a YouTube channel. Mm -hmm. um, tell me more about about this. Well, you know, you can go create a YouTube account, and then you can basically create your own custom uh, channel page. It's like a homepage on YouTube with you know your company logo and your company colors, and, and start uploading videos so that you could. A lot, of a lot of benefits there. One, you can refer customers or prospects to it to, to look at different videos. Plus, uh, YouTube uh, is indexed in, in Google, so you can get uh, uh, better placement in Google. Some of the videos in YouTube will show up in Google search results. So, so if I create a video and put that video on YouTube, does that then become uh, internet property, kind of like real estate on the internet, where it, c it can be indexed and searched. Is that what you're? Yes. Oh, yes. Okay. Those those pages and the in the the description of the videos and the keywords associated with those videos are indexable by the search engines. And does it if if a video gets a lot of views, does that make it more popular on Google, maybe or? Uh, it, it yes and no. I mean, it, it becomes if if people start linking to it, it becomes more popular on Google. Um, and then the more pay, more views on within YouTube, you know, it's going to show up more often in, in YouTube search results for popular videos. Mm -hmm. yeah. Okay, so now uh, we do video and, and so forth, so I'm going to chime in a little bit here as far as how you can create a video on YouTube and then 
And well, I saw on one of your websites where you took a, a video that was on YouTube, one of your clients created, and put it on their website. Right. Uh, yeah, because you can easily embed any YouTube video into your website, and there's you know a lot of benefit there. Number one, the the bandwidth and the the, the is not on your server; it's on the YouTube server. So mm -hmm. um, you know you don't have to worry about you know, using a whole bunch of memory and, and, and bandwidth on your on your hosting company. So you can you can then create a um, create a video, create create a YouTube channel, create a video, and uh, upload the video to to YouTube, and then from there you can drive traffic to the YouTube channel, right. or you can just pull the pull the video with the embed code and put that in, into the fabric of your website. Yes, you can do either. And then another thing we recommend to clients is just to, um, you know, when they're in the sales process, and if, if you're a residential remodeling co company and, and, and a customer says, well, what, ha what happens when you tear out my, my old deck? Like, how does that work? If you have a video of that, a two minute video of you guys actually doing that, you can refer them while you're standing there in their kitchen consulting with them, you can pull up the YouTube channel and say, here, here's a video of us tearing down a deck or, or tearing down something, and, and it, it helps them visualize what, what could happen doing business with you. And YouTube is, 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 a free, is a free service. Again, all these ideas and tips are free. All right, so that wraps up our time here with Jay Cap. Jay, thank you so much for being a guest on Thrive America and taking the time to come out to our studio and discuss some tips and tricks and ways that people can use the internet right now for free to, to develop uh, uh, an online presence and so forth. So uh, just tell us again how somebody watching this may want to get in touch with you to develop a professional website. Sure. Uh, well, we're located in the uh, Dunwoody Chambly area of Atlanta. Our phone number is 678-336-5277 and they can visit our website at CAP, K -A -P -P, concepts spelled with a K dot com um, and we're happy to give a free consultation they can come by the office or we can come meet with them and um, talk to them about their internet marketing needs <laughs>